Okay, now this is pretty interesting here. Um, this came out today on the examiner. Uh, I guess they talked to some physicists and they are claiming that possibly the sinkhole methane could have been tied to the Minden explosion and what would have set that off, the trigger for that would have been a meteorite which is hot when it comes through the atmosphere when it comes to earth and then uh, yeah I guess there were 10 explosions over uh, Monday night at Camp Minden and let's see basically they found the physicists are saying if there's methane in the air then that the rocks could ignite it um, there's all kinds of stuff in this article though they uh, there's a couple comments from people talking about how they saw something they saw a meteorite coming down right before the explosion um, yeah there's like all these I guess if a meteorite hits one of those bunkers too those ammo bunkers they can set it off it can set off like a natural gas mine they can set those off um, so it's kind of a big deal like I guess there's a meteor shower coming this weekend too and they're asking could there be more methane explosions this weekend uh, something to watch out for if, you know if you see this uh, yeah something triggered an emergency flare at a well uh, if one of those wells goes off it'd be one and a half thermonuclear bombs worth of power so um, yeah and the other thing is that someone triangulated uh, a few different things that hit and I guess they share an aquifer uh, all the points so somehow they're seeing that the aquifer is transferring the gas over to different areas and then it's like popping up and then a meteorite set it off so it's probably not that good to have huge methane clouds just hanging out there and all that that's going on with that sinkhole I don't you're gonna have to look into that but yeah here's basically a connection between a possible connection between the Camp Minden Louisiana explosion and the Louisiana sinkhole so definitely go check out this article